so after losing the world test championship final 2023 team india had started a new test championship cycle with a tour to west indies so india had to kick start of their wtc 2325 cycle with a west indies tour and that is a two match test series and the first test match was played at the windsor park in tommy so west indies skipper craig brathwaite had won the toss and he decided to bat first and yes india had handed over to debut to two new young talents yashashwi cheswal and ishan kishan so west indies opting to bat first they did not get off to a good start as the indian spinners ravindra jadeja and ravi chandran ashwin started getting into the act as soon as possible mohammad siraj jaydev munakar chadu thakur bowled really well up front and they did not let the windy batsmen get off to a fly and eventually west indies folded their first innings for a paltry score of just 150 runs with ravi ashwin picking up five wickets ravindra jadeja picking up two wickets three wickets rather and then Mohammad Siraj and Shardul Thakur picking up one wicket apiece and then the Windies batsman Alec Athanes he was the top scorer scoring 47 runs and so in reply to West Indies score of just 150 runs India started with their new opening pair Rohit Sharma and the debutant Yashashwi Jaiswal and just before the start of the game rohit sharma had told that shubman gill he himself wanted to bat at number 3 so it was an easy decision for the team management to slot up jaiswal up the order and yes the debutant he showed lots of guts and courage to bat on that spinning track in dominica and he respected the good deliveries and put away the bad deliveries to the fourth and then rohit sharma and jaiswal started putting on a brilliant partnership and they started tiring out the windies bowlers and these two put on a mammoth opening partnership of 229 runs and guys this is the third highest opening partnership for india in a week test and in the process rohit sharma he completed his 10th test match 100 scoring 103 runs and jaiswal what a dream debut he had scoring 171 runs on his first innings of his international career i mean it was a treat to watch for all the indian fans and this was the 17th instance for team india that a uh, debutant has gone on and scored a test 100 and it is a really special one for the young talent and with this india also created a record and that is it is for the very first time that the indian team had taken a lead in the first innings without losing a wicket also to mention that this was jaiswal's first test 100 and it is the third best test debut by an indian batsman after shikhar dhawan's 187 against australia and rohit sharma's 177 on test debut and this is the third highest score by an indian batsman on test day and soon after jaiswal had lost his wicket virat kohli also stepped up to the occasion and he scored a brilliant innings of 76 runs accompanied by Jadeja's useful contribution of 37 runs and after that Rohit Sharma decided that it's enough for that pitch and it was really assisting the spinners so India had declared for 421 runs after losing 5 wickets and going into the second innings the West Indies had a deficit of 271 runs and they had to overcome that in order to make India bat again in the second innings but then the spinner especially Ravi Chandran Ashwin he created havoc in the West Indies batting lineup and none of the West Indies batsmen could even get off to a respectable score and eventually West Indies had folded for just 130 runs 
with Ashwin, the chief destructor, taking up seven wickets, and with this, he also equaled record with Rangana Herat with the most number of fifers in Test cricket history. That is 34 fifers in Test history, surpassing Jimmy Anderson's 32 fifers in Test cricket. Let me share you a trivia here that Ravi Chandran Ashwin has become the first Indian bowler to dismiss a father-son duo in Test cricket history. So Ravi Chandran Ashwin has dismissed both Shiv Narayan Chandapal and now his son as well, Tang Narayan Chandapal. And so for the man of the match, none other than a dream debut for Yashasvi Jaiswal scoring 171 runs on test debut and with 16 fours and 1-6, he rightly deserved the man of the match for this first test match. And so with India going 1-0 up, now both the teams will be travelling to the Port of Spain in Trinidad for the second test match and we have to wait and watch what happens whether West Indies will come and level the series one all or will India go and take the series to see. And so after Yashashvi Jaiswal's fantastic dream debut, the Twitter world was taken with a lot of storm as a lot of cricketers and ex-cricketers congratulated him. So let's take a look at all the reactions in the social media. So I'll be bringing all the updates of the second test match to be held in the Port of Spain in Trinidad from the 20th of July. So do stay tuned to my channel guys and yes, if you are watching this channel for the very first time, then do not forget to subscribe and press the bell icon. That's it for now. Thanks for your time. Thanks for